So understanding how to treat hair fall, you first need to kind of understand how your hair naturally grows. So this is basically the cycle of your hair growth. So on an average person, we have about 100,000 hair on the head, on the scalp. And uh, most of it, about 80 to 90% of the hair on your head at this moment while you're speaking is at a growth stage or antigen phase. That basically means that it's growing, it is healthy, it has a good blood supply and Typically, in an average and healthy individual, uh, your hair grows about a centimeter every month or maybe an inch every two months. And this growth phase usually lasts between two to eight years, depending on what's happening in your life and stuff like that. But an average eight years and then they usually go to the next phase, which is the catagen phase. And about one or two percent of your hair is usually in this stage. It's a transition phase. When your hair is done growing, it doesn't need any more growth. So it starts coming looser from its roots. And the third phase is called the telogen phase, which is the resting phase. This is when your hair is done growing. Uh, it's about to shed. So it's resting. And about uh, 10 to 20 percent of your hair is usually in this phase. So if you are looking at your head right now and you have, say, 100,000 hairs, about like I said, 90% is at growth phase and then 10% is at a resting phase. And that's where naturally you see a random hair fall on an average day. About 50 to 100 hair fall on an average day is normal because that's pretty much how many hairs are at resting phase. And the resting phase usually lasts about three months. So your hair is resting for three months and then it will go and be shed off and another hair will come and replace it. So usually... In the resting phase, the new hair starts growing and it starts pushing out the old hair, which was in the telogen phase, so resting phase. So it takes about three months for your hair to stay at rest and then it starts falling off. It's natural to see between 50 to 100, sometimes up to 200, but I guess no more than 200 hair a day is an average hair fall. Any more than that, then it is probably that you're having that significant hair loss have one of those two conditions that I talked about earlier.